Today we're going to take a look at the ArcGIS integration with Laserfiche from Cities Digital. What I'd like to start out with is to show you a little bit around the map. We'll zoom out so you can see the congressional districts and you can see that we have another layer plotted with our recent fires. I'm going to turn off my congressional districts layer so I can only view my fire layers within the map. If I select one of the different points on the map, it's going to show me the information about the map that I have on that particular layer and link directly to my documents in Laserfish. You'll see the relevant metadata on the left hand side corresponding to the specific document like the type, the document number, the category, and the date. Another handy way to see the documents associated with the items on the map is to view below in our filtered map extent. You'll be able to see all the documents that correspond to all the points on the map that have laser fish documents. Now we'll add in another layer. We'll add the Laserfish Congressional Folders layer to the map. I can click on any one of the layers on the map, but in this case, I'll choose the Congressional Folders layer. When I click on it, I'm instantly displayed the documents that are associated. I can click on one of those links to display the document in Laserfish. I might want to add a document to the system, and I can do that by choosing Edit. From here, I'm presented with a dialog box showing me all the metadata. This is specific to a folder. I can choose to add a document from here. We've now added that to our Laserfish system, and I can close. Before I do that, I can also choose to delete documents right from here as well. And I'll close. Now let's take a look at what that looks like inside the Laserfish system. Here it is, the real documents behind the scenes associated with Congressional District 46. And how does it get there? Through the metadata pane. I hope you've enjoyed a quick tour through the Laserfish and ArcGIS integration from Cities Digital.